Hello everyone, this is Miss Chen Fei. Today, I'm going to show you how to make a turkey by using construction papers. Now, let's get started. For the supplies, you will need some construction papers. Make sure you have different colors, a pencil, a glue stick, a pair of scissors, and some tape. You can either have tape or glue stick. You don't need both of them. First, we are going to cut this brown piece of construction paper into a long rectangle. Please make sure your rectangle is long enough to roll into a cylinder. Then, we are going to put some glue on a short side of the rectangle. After the glue stick, make sure you hold it for about 3 to 5 seconds and let the two pieces of paper stay together. Now you may leave your cylinder on the side and let's move on to the next step. Now let's choose some colors for the feathers. As you may see from this picture, I have six different colors for the feathers. So you may go with what I have, which other colors from the rainbow, or choose your own color. Just make sure all six strips will be the same size. After I collect all six colors, I will cut all the strips together. The only reason I'm doing this this way because all the strips will have the same size. If you have trouble to cut them together, you may only do two or three pieces at one time and then do the other three next round. After you have all six strips, you may want to thinking about how would you like to put them in order. I decided to go with the order of the rainbow, so I start from the left, will be red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and pinkish purple. Of course, you can choose a different order, but the reason why I put them in order here because when you glue them on the back of the turkey, you have to follow the specific order. So first, let's glue the first one on the left, which will be the red one. You only need some glue at the very end of one side, and then close the paper. It's not exactly like a ring, it's more like a drop of water shape and then hold it for at least 3 seconds and then put the strip on the back of the cylinder which will be the body of your turkey. The second strip we're going to work on will not be the orange one. Instead, we are going to pick the purple one and you are going to glue this on the right hand side of your turkey, not next to the red one. When you have the purple one ready, you are going to glue on the right hand side. Make sure it's the opposite side of the red strip. Next, we are going to work on the orange one. Just repeat the same steps and make sure when you glue your orange one, it's going to be next to the red strip, not the purple one. After orange will be color blue, the same step, and also make sure 
the blue one does not go next to the orange. It will go next to the purple one, which will be the second one on the right hand side. When you work with glue stick or liquid glue, it is very important to hold it after you put the glue together. At least hold it for 3 to 5 seconds. The more paper you have, the longer you want to hold it. So next, we are going to work on the yellow strip, which will be next to the orange one. Last but not least, we have the green strip. It will go in between yellow and blue one. Now, let's work on the eyes. If you have googly eyes, you may use googly eyes to put the eye on. If you do not have googly eyes, you may just do what I'm doing here. Use a piece of white paper and draw two eyeballs and then cut them off. Now let's work on the beak. For the beak, you only need a tiny piece of yellow paper and fold it in half and then draw a triangle and then cut the triangle off. When you open it, you should have a diamond shape. The reason why we have a diamond because we are going to glue one half of the diamond on the turkey and the other half could be the upper part of the beak. For the wattle part of the turkey, you're just going to draw some wiggly lines and then make a random shape and carefully cut around the line. Last part will be you glue the wattle next to the beak. Now you just finished your turkey.
Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. See you next time.